Hello everyone, my name is Durga. I'm a mental health counselor and trainer from HealthServe. Thank you for watching this video about care for self. In the first part of the video, we learned about what is stress and how do we get stress. In the second part, we learn the different signs of stress. In this video, we will help you understand how to manage stress by self-care and useful tips. When stressed, most of us tend to do some kind of comforting activity. Some prefer to eat their favorite comfort food. I mostly eat chicken biryani. I'm not saying biryani is a medicine to my stress. But while eating it, it reminds me of my mom and brings on memories that are comforting and makes me happy. Some prefer to watch a movie, while some like to listen to music. These comforting activities are called self-care. But when we are too busy in life or experiencing severe stress, we don't give importance to self-care. Practicing self-care not only helps us feel better, it boosts our energy. It provides clarity and also allows us to function our best. So if you're planning to start today, here are four tips for instant self-care. You can learn it from the word self. Let's see how. S is for smile. A smile is the happiness you will find right under your nose. I'm not saying you to hide your stress and smile and pretend that everything is okay when it's not. But research tells us that if you smile, your brain will release chemicals that will help you to improve your mood and helps your heart. Let's focus on smiling more for the entire week starting today. Begin with creating a smiling cue. When I say smiling cue, they are the ones that remind you to smile. Some keep a picture of their loved ones in the wallet or phone wallpaper. The picture itself does not mean to evoke smile, but think of the lovely memories associated with the picture. Maybe a picture of you holding your baby for the first time, a picture of your first day at work, a picture of you visiting the favorite spot in Singapore. It's the memories that bring comfort to you while watching them. If you want pictures, you can also use videos that make you smile, like jokes as your ringtone. If you're bored of the pictures, jokes, or ringtone, change it to a new one. Remember, smiling helps to reduce the effects on the stress but it does not remove the problem. So every day you look at a picture, make sure you smile. Think of the happy moments. Every time your phone rings, enjoy the moment and don't forget to smile. Next comes E. E is for exercise. Our body and mind are like rail tracks. It needs to stay parallel to smoothly run the train called life. So when you're physically unwell, it may affect your mental well-being. For example, being unable to sleep well would make you feel tired the next day. You just can't work. You just can't concentrate. So when we say exercise, you don't have to go on full gym mode. But try simple exercises like walking, stretching, this could be done just for 20 to 30 minutes a day. If you're ambitious, you can also start 5,000 steps and progress slowly to 10,000 steps a day. This could be within your dormitory or within your room. Inspire your friends. If they want to join, start making group exercises. I'm sure it will be fun. The next we see is L. L means love, but it's not just love for others, but love for self. When you look at the mirror, do you like the face what you see? It is important 
you love yourself for others to love you. Look at you and start accepting you. The famous saying goes, it is okay when you do not feel okay. Accept it. Stress is normal. It's not a sign of weakness or that you're not man enough. Remember, if you can't learn to love yourself and all the flaws, you can love other people so much better. And that will definitely make you happy. So let's begin to love ourselves starting today. The next one is F means find a friend you can talk to. Self-care doesn't mean all you have to do it by yourself. This friend can be a one living in Singapore or your hometown. It is the trust that matters and inspires you to let go. Sometimes just even talking about what is making you stressed can definitely help. Remember, when stressed, you do not need to go to doctor or take medications. Just talk. This can be talking on face-to-face -face or dialing a friend. Talk about some unusual topics. It need not be topics about your problems or stress alone. Talk about happy moments. Talk about sad moments. Talk about the weather. Talk about nothing to talk today. <laughs> Just talk out and let go. So if we summarize, self-care isn't hard, isn't it? It's easy. All you have to know is S E N F. S is smile, E is exercise, L is love yourself, and F is find a friend. Try it out this week. See how the week goes. End of the week, look at yourself in the mirror and tell it out loud. Don't worry, you're cared for. If you feel great, Give yourself a good pat for good self-care. If not, give yourself double pat for trying again next week. Self-care doesn't happen on a few days. It's a habit that helps you go on for a long term. We saw various tips on self-care. Now let's see a common technique that might help you right away. One simple and common technique to manage stress is calming your mind by breathing exercise. Breathing helps us to slow down your heart and also helps to clear your mind. So what do you say? Shall we try it together? But before we get started, let me give you some important information on breathing exercise. It is common for our mind to wander during breathing exercise. Just try to focus back on breathing. Always inhale through your nose and exhale through nose or mouth. Always count your breath. It could be five counts every breath. Let's begin by making yourself comfortable as seen in the picture. Sit in a chair. It could be your chair or even your bed. Allow your back to be straight with the feet firmly on the ground. If you're using a phone, just keep it on the side or probably on your lap and make your hands free. Now bring your right hand towards your chest and left hand over your stomach. Once you're comfortable in this position, slowly close your eyes and follow my instruction. Let's take a deep breath through our nose. One, two, three, four, five. Slowly breathe out through your mouth. Four, three, two, one. Take a deep breath again through your nose. One, two, feel your stomach expand. Breathe out through your mouth. Four, three, two, one. Take a deep breath again through your nose. One, two, three, 
three, chest expand. Now breathe out to your mouth. Four, three, two, one. Take another deep breath. One, two, three. Feel your chest and stomach expand. Now breathe out. Four, three, two, one. Take another deep breath. One, two, three, four, five. Breathe out. Four, three, two, one. Take another deep breath. One, two, three, four, five. Breathe out and feel your chest and stomach going in. Three, two, one. One last time. Take a deep breath through your nose. One, two, three, four, five. And breathe out. Focus on your breathing and let go. Four, Three, two, one. Now exhale fully. And when you're ready, slowly open your eyes and return your attention to the present moment. Now you can practice this breathing exercise at any place where you find safe and comfortable. You can practice it in the morning or in the night. Make sure you do it at least 10 times a day. When performed in the night, it helps to improve good sleep. Now we have learned some interesting self-care tips and of course the calming technique, the breathing exercise. Remember, self-care helps your physical and mental well-being. In this video of Care for Self, I thank you for watching it. In the first part of the video, we learned about stress and everyone faces and handles stress differently. The unmanaged and long-term stress can be harmful. In the second part, we saw our body shows different combination of signs when stressed. In this video, we learned that self-care is very important for physical and mental well-being. So I hope this topic was helpful to you. If you would like to have more information or speak to someone, you may contact us at HealthServe through our hotline, website, or social media. Remember, you are not alone. So with that thought, I wish you a caring and stress-free day ahead. Thank you.